Hello everyone! Good captions are working. Everything seems to be working. Let me know if the sound balance sounds okay. Um, so yeah, this is the third live stream, but it is day four and I didn't come up with a new thumbnail. I wasn't sure if we'd stream today, but I wish I had streamed yesterday because so much cool stuff happened in the game. I might turn those into videos. Um, but yeah, we're, we're back with the Hello Kitty game. I sort of wanted this game to not be good so that I wouldn't play it all the time, but it appears I like it and <laughs> want to play more of it. So we are on day four. Things happened. I found a mermaid tail so I can swim like a mermaid. I did the comic relief quest yesterday and now I can also dye my clothes different colors, but they're all so cute. And I love all the different color combinations that I haven't dyed anything yet because I can't make up my mind. Um, so I've this is the first time I'm logging in today so we can see what we can gift people. Um, we have the ability where Hello Kitty is going to teach me a recipe each day so we can learn to cook. And I opened the potion shop so we can go inside the pumpkin house now. Um, so we can learn to do potions, level up friendship so that we can see what the next quest is. And if we take somebody swimming with us, they're going to be a mermaid now. So yeah, I'm sure there's daily quests and some other things that we'll find. This will be a shorter live stream, probably two-ish hours, we'll see. Instead of the like, you know, seven and a half, five and a half that we've done in the last ones. So it seems like each time I come in, like they're here to greet me. So we have my melody welcoming us back. Oh dear, Daniel is visiting again. Okay, he wasn't here yesterday, um, but I guess he's back. We get a bed today. See, those daily rewards. You gotta keep coming back. Um, I don't, I don't really want to emote about the bed, but thank you. Oh no, I clicked it. <laughs> Sometimes the buttons click really fast, so we get more strawberries and things. Oh, five game tickets. Okay. Maybe I'll actually try the games this time. Let's see what our dailies are. Okay, so just gifting four gifts. We can do that anyway. Give Hello Kitty an apple. Oh, and tell her it's from him, okay. So, gift. Gift my melody an item with the bread tag, the yummy tag, something like that. I wonder if we have to do like, is that going to count as one of our gifts or one of her gifts? Entirely point. Oh, get two magnums. Okay, these? Oh, there is a game up there, and I haven't tried the game yet where you can collect these. So if I can't find them out in the world, then that might be something that we get to try because I haven't really done the mini games yet. Wait, and then let me check the quest log. If anything is unlocked or what we need to do. So, ref okay, level 11. I don't know what level she is right now, but unless she's really high, I don't think we're getting into level 11. Maybe level 7. I feel like level 5 is doable, and those are both the gemstone, the our crystal quests. Ocean Hunt 2. Okay. So we can go talk to Romy. Um, yeah, we need to do both of those, which depending on how high we can get friendship today. And then these are the daily ones that we just looked at. The friendship quest with Hello Kitty is the learning to cook. Let's go see her because she'll have us cook something. And then that'll also give us something that we can gift to my melody. talk to her for this part. I'm gonna have to gift her too. Okay, I feel like... didn't we make that already? I think I have pineapples and flowers so we can just go ahead and make that. Yeah. 
getting low on apples. I might have to do the apples in the game too. Okay, so we cooked the pineapple stack cake. And she'll, she'll give us a new recipe each day now that we're friends. And we're leveling up our cooking ability. I think what I'm gonna do... Um, I'm gonna have her hang out with us. And I'm gonna cook some things since we have to gift some things. Because her ability is that she might give us extra things when we're cooking. Um, so let's cook some stuff. Don't let me use up all my apples though. But what was it? Oh, I can still only... I thought I could put more ingredients, but I guess not. I wonder when we level up the... Like, the stove so that we can put more elements in it. Because that's one of her two heart presents. Let's see. I'm gonna make... I think I'm safe to make another one. And I think I'm going to keep my apples, but let's think. I think my Melody likes things with the strawberries. Or maybe it's just sweet things. Um, or does she give us strawberries? Either way, we can make something with strawberries. We've got so many right now. I've been gifting her the swamp mellows. <laughs> you got this game? How? How did you get this game? Also, are you liking it? Have you started playing it? Um, oh, and we got an extra one. On your phone. Yeah, see? See? There are so many. Like, the iPhone, I don't have one. I don't. But so many of the people I know who, like, have PCs and they play that way, they have it on their phone or they have it on their iPad that they... Or they have a phone or an iPad, so they could still play it. Um, I've been hearing from people it takes a lot of battery, so... Tonight when your kids go to bed, nice. Um, let's see. What else should we cook? Let's see what happens if I put the marshmallow in with the flour. I have no idea what this is going to make. I wonder if there's like a generic you baked a thing. Cake. I'm going to say that cake is probably the most generic thing that we can bake. What if we cook with a banana? Is it going to be a banana bread or is it just going to be cake? Cake. Yeah, I made some elaborate things in the espresso machine yesterday and uh, most of them were just coffee. <laughs> I'd put in like one ingredient and get this really fancy drink and then I'd put in like, you know, three of them or something thinking, yes, this makes a lot of sense or this is really silly and they were all just coffee. So I think cake is the equivalent. Great. And I have some extra cake now. I wish that they would maintain the tags of the items that you put in it. Like I want to use the chocolate, but like I also don't want to use the chocolate. I put that seaweed in something. What? Wait, what did I just put in? I didn't pay any attention. You made a macaron. Ow. What did I put in there? <laughs> oh, was that the almond? That makes sense. What if I put in the seaweed? I like just trying out the random things. <laughs> what they make. Sugar kelp cakes. See, that's what I kind of expect. If I put the banana on, why am I not getting a banana cake? Why is it a regular cake? And we made some extra. This Hello Kitty is here. Um, like I don't want to waste stuff, but I also just want to make a bunch of things. What if we put the milk? It's gonna be cake, isn't it? It's always just gonna be cake. Milk bread. 
And it's got like barnacles and seaweed on it because it was the underwater. I don't remember what it's called. Coral milk, maybe? Let's try one more. This seems weird, though. What if we do the... The... the it's probably going to be cake, but... The, I don't know. What is that? Sugar cloud? <laughs> Something like that. Pastry! I made pastry. When are you going to let me use more than one ingredient in here? Okay, we need to give her gifts... We're required to give her an apple, so we'll give her the apple. Um, what else can we give you? Oh, she likes the strawberry shortcake too. Got so many pies. I should probably make more of that pineapple thing. Because that's somebody's like favorite. Level six, we get the Hello Kitty bookcase. I feel like I need to make a video that's just like, here's where you can get a ton of Hello Kitty furniture. Because I've been finding it in the weirdest places. Like in some of the temples, in random chests, and then you also get it from leveling up. Um, we have two more. I'll try this one. More tofu. And then... One more, right? Yeah. Right now, I think that's the best pie that I can make. Alright, and so we can't get her to level 7 yet. I want to stop hanging out with her. Oh, let's actually find out what she can tell us. Yeah, that's not... That wasn't really news. So they will give you hints as to the favorite gifts of the other villagers. Uh, yeah. Okay, so we're not hanging out with her anymore. Let's go. We need to give my Melody something that is baked. We did just bake the strawberry shortcake. I think she likes that. Uh, I was like, what? Why are they all... Oh, she likes all of these. Oh, no. Well. This one's only got two tags, so I'm more inclined to give it to her because some of those other ones are two hearts for other folks. Brooke, thank you for whatever that is. Is that a super sticker? I've never seen one before on my channel. <laughs> but thank you. That's neat. You didn't have to do it. Hi for being YouTube partner. Thank you. I, to be honest, um, I didn't actively turn on the super chats and the, the super stickers like YouTube did it. And so I was surprised the first time it happened, just like I'm surprised today because I forgot. <laughs> Thank you. You totally don't have to do that. Um, but that's neat. Exciting. I keep forgetting that the things are there and it went so fast. I haven't figured out like what we should do for badges or emotes or memberships or anything yet. So those aren't turned on yet. Um, but if people have ideas, please, please tell me the ideas because I have been so busy with this game. I didn't I didn't expect to, you know, stream this game for seven and a half hours on the first day it came out, but we did. And it's very much a daily, like there's all those daily things. It is so exciting. It's, I like just having the, just having the thing to be like, hey, I can check something off, like a little achievement. That's one of the things I had liked um, about the idea of streaming on Twitch is you have so much gamification of, hey, you did this thing. Hey, you did this thing. Welcome in, Hassan. Um, we are on day four of Hello Kitty Island Adventure, and I am currently gifting villagers. Okay, she's still just... Do we have any idea if the different colors are meaningful? Like, this is a green thing. This is a blue thing. These are green. Like, is the order meaningful? I wonder. 
Because I was going to say, is it the number of tags? Is it anything else? Are the things towards the top things that they like better? I don't know. This is Hello Kitty Island Adventure. It is currently only on Apple Arcade. I'm hoping they expand it to other platforms. So I'm playing it on my Mac on my laptop because that's what I stream on. Um, it's got elements of Animal Crossing. It has Zelda elements too because it has little puzzles and things. Um, there are no in-app purchases like there are in like Disney Dreamlight Valley. Um, but it has kind of, there's like, mysteries and stories you have to figure out you're leveling up friendship unlocking tools and then there's little like puzzles and things um i people were like oh it's super cute but it's a mobile game it's apple only i have been surprised how good it is how giant the map is and there's still like we know of two updates that are definitely coming there's gonna be um They've talked about they're going to do events in-game. Um, so it, it is going to be a living game with a lot of new stuff. And it's just, it's it helps that it's really cute. There's still all the like fishing and bug catching, but there's also swimming and diving. And I haven't gotten to mining yet, but there's that. Um, was that our third gift? Are we done with her now? Yes. Okay. I didn't get any additional unlocks. Do I have anything for him? I did make some random coffee. Yes! Look at this, look at this. I've got a three heart gift. I don't think I've had a three heart gift yet. This is the chocolate chai. I wish I remembered how I made that. But chocolate chai is a cinnamon roll three heart gift. I think each one only has one gift that is three hearts. So I have a three heart, I have a two heart with the mocha, and um, then a bunch of one hearts. So let's give him this. I think because I've made it, it's in my recipes now. And so because it's in my recipes, I should be able to make it again. I'm still so low level with him because I didn't gift him at all the first day because I didn't know anything. Like until you can dive, I don't think there are any recipes I can like make or any gifts I can find for him. All right, now we're to level five. Strawberry shortcake avatar palette. Okay, so each character, like you unlock that character's color palette, but then you can also unlock additional color palettes from friendship with them. Um, I think I still have one more. Or this. I don't know if it matters which one of those. All right, so those are my three for over here. <laughs> it's already nighttime. Um, we do need to pick up absolutely everything. I think that the resources only respawn overnight, and there's not that many of them. So I feel like if I miss one, oh hey, he's running. Let's go for a jog. I don't know if I can actually catch up to him. Oh, I see. If you stand in front of one of the characters, um, ooh, I like the candelabra. You can actually stop them from moving. Like, they won't run around you. Level six, we got the spooky candelabra. I like all the spooky sets. Where are you? Um, yeah. I think for him, we should probably try to cook something. I haven't used the pizza oven at all. So I think we could get better than a one-star gift for him. Let me catch this crap. <laughs> I found a way yesterday inside the volcano, and I fished in a pool of lava, and I caught a fish. And a guitar? Like, how did I catch a guitar? Oh no, I don't want to trade because I don't understand what trading is for. Everything I have for you is one star. Why is it all one star? Try 
wonder what he likes. Does he like anything that I can make? Or do I have to find it? Is that... Is that pizza? Is, is like pizza one of the categories? And like what? Jokes? I don't even know. Do we know what this is? Oh, that's just a... Is it just a house? I should probably decorate additional houses. What have you got for me today? The purple goth elegant dress. I think that's maybe the first thing I've seen in here that I kind of like. I don't know if it goes with the colors of my character, but look at this. This is something that I unlocked yesterday. I'll probably do a video on it, but like I can pick any of the clothing that I have so far. So here's like the dress I'm wearing and we can change the color. I really like that one. I really like this one. This one's also cute. Or if you're more of a pastel person, you can change your whole witch costume to be pastel. But like some of these have a ton of colors. Um, some only have a few colors. So I imagine we're gonna maybe expand the different colors, but I'm not sure. But like, this makes me like so much of the clothing so much more because a lot of times I'm just like, no. This is my mermaid tail, so I could change the color of my mermaid tail. So we definitely want to be picking up all of those dye pouches so we can change the colors of things. Oh, wait, I didn't give him anything, did I? <laughs> um, Because yeah, some of the clothing I've been ignoring because I was like, ah, it doesn't look nice. To be honest, I'm probably going to wear the mermaid stuff like most of the time because it actually gives you a power-up. You can breathe more underwater when you're wearing the mermaid tail. Well, the whole mermaid outfit, I think. Level 6, we get even more colors for the avatar. But now that I can change the colors of everything, I don't know if it matters. Like... Have I donated though? Oh wait, we don't donate fish, right? So it doesn't matter if I give away fish? I mean, we can do the catch and release thing. I don't know if there's an achievement for like catching and releasing every fish, maybe? Or if it's okay if I just give them away to random people? Oh, whoops. I'm talking to him instead. Oh, let's try this one more. Hi, Lori. That is a funny username. Um, welcome in. All right, that was three, right? So we've gifted him. I need to pick stuff up. I also... Wait, there was something here I can pick up? What is it? A stick. Nice. I... I did another one of the jumpy puzzle style temples last night that was like, you know, I fall into the abyss a few times and then you finally get to the chest and again, <laughs> it was, it was sticks. It was just sticks in the chest and I was like, what is going on? Um... I don't know why I came this way, thinking that there would be more materials. I also wish I knew how high up I needed to be for my balloon glide to actually work. Like, that time it worked, but what? How is there another chest over here? Are they, like, dropping chests in periodically? Coastal decorative plant. I feel like we may need that in the future. Like, how did I miss this island before? Unless there are new chests spawning. I didn't think there were, but now I'm like, maybe. Do you think different chests come each day? Right here, let's put on the mermaid outfit. 
And that way, each time when I go in the water, um, if I need to dive, I'll be able to breathe underwater and just swimming. I'm a mermaid now. And if I take somebody with me, they will also be a mermaid. That is one of the things I unlocked when I wasn't streaming. But I do have a video on that I'm working on, hopefully coming out in the next 24 hours, with the specific locations of each of those pieces. I know we found two of them on stream in day two. And that's probably marked. Excuse me, I would like to come up for air. Oh, I'm under the dock. <laughs> it's like, why can't I can't I surface? Um I found a chest over here at the corner of the buoys that I think also had a piece of Hello Kitty furniture in it. I might be swimming out too far. But let's go. Let me check the quest log. Who do we want to level up? Oh, we do need to do the collecting the fire bloom. So maybe let's go in that direction. I'm trying to see if there's. I feel like the coconuts are one of the like not so common resources, and so I don't like missing those and the rubber. Like if you can't dive yet. Collect and keep all of your rubber. Don't make anything optional with it because you're gonna want it when you have to craft the snorkel. Let me grab some water. Okay. Um. Yeah, so I'm like... I'm collecting things, but we're gonna go, I think, over to where Retsuko is. Also, if you're trying to find the, what is he, Scraggy's crawler or something like that, there's a spider that's difficult to find and it's in that temple. Um, which I found by accident and then I saw so many posts in the Discord asking where to find it. And that is where to find it. I caught it. I think at noon, I'm not really sure how the in-game clock registers time. Usually something back there. Oh, we probably can give Choco Cat too. I now have an ability with Choco Cat that if I craft, I could end up with extra stuff from crafting if he's hanging out with me. only have one star things. Alright, maybe I'll give him one and then we'll see if we can get something better. Um, oh, we also need to go see Kuromi for our daily quest, right? Let's do that maybe. So these I placed, we found all of these items on stream for this quest and then I did the quest off stream. Um, but I'm thinking I might put that in a short video of just like how to do that, how to find the things, put them together. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> I like that Kuropi is so easy to find two star gifts for once you have the net. It's like any of the bugs in the swamp. He's like, yeah, I want those. And they're so easy to catch. They posted on the Twitter, the Twitter, their Twitter, <laughs> uh, yesterday with little profiles of some of the characters and like recommended early game gifts. And I think for him, it was the Lily Frog. He can be our companion. He has Critter Calmer ability. Why are you running? <laughs> Where are you running to? Seriously though, where are you why are you running away? What? I didn't I I, I didn't know they could do that. 
You s I gave him a present. He sprinted away to a mailbox and teleported away from me? Where did he go? And now he is, he's on the dock. Did I... Did we, like... Did, did I get a quest? And he's, like, in position for the quest, maybe? <laughs> what was that? Suspicious sounds. Level 14 was cinema roll. Okay, so it's not that. Um, that was... What the heck? Um, I wonder if it's a time of day thing, or, like, what triggered that? So we're gonna have to give him more stuff. I wanted to test out his his critter ability, and uh, you know, didn't really expect him to sprint off like that. Um, okay. Come, come on. <laughs> Still just like, what just happened? Um, we also hey. I don't know what the mushrooms are for. I haven't really paid attention. I just feel like I need to collect every one of them. I did say I'm low on apples. Let's see what this mini game is like. I haven't done it yet. I know we we have these tickets and we can use them. One minute, grab as many apples as you can. Okay. Oh, I thought it was only the trees. Get out of the wall! Okay, so it's not the trees. Wait, there's no apples here. I wish I could jump over their walls. Help me! <laughs> Do we actually get any from the trees? Because, like, I was gonna aim for the trees, but I don't know if they count. Because, like, the apples don't disappear or anything. Where are they? <laughs> Sorry. I could hear the thing, and then it showed me more than one apple, and I was, like, a little unsure which way to go. Okay. Alright. One ticket. I also got a blue brain hat. <laughs> Do you think this is the way you unlock, like... Okay, so some of the little ghosty guys in this area have really good hats. I wonder if this is how you get the additional hats? I also got mushrooms. And a bonus apple. Welcome in, Shelly! I love watching you play this game. I'm glad! Because I know... It's not on every device, so not everybody can play it, but I always end up watching people playing PC games that I can't play. I kind of want to do that again, but maybe we should see what the other mini games are like, because I think we're going to need one. Great pumpkins and pumpkin spiders. I feel like there aren't as many pumpkins. Okay, but there's two back there, and I feel like I only had one back there before. I am still so surprised at... That, like, this game is much better than I was anticipating. Like, it's very playable. <laughs> the controller support is really good. Can I... can I jump in their boat? So I would like to. No. Wait. He's got a mermaid tiara. <gasps> I'm in the boat. I'm in the boat. I'm in the boat. And let's see if the camera can zoom around that tree. I wish I had jumped in the boat in an area where you could actually, you know, see the boat a little bit better. Hey, we match. Well, mine has a gold star. His is silver. But I wonder, you know how you can give them hats? Could I give him a hat? No. Okay. I was gonna say that might be another way to get, like, a thing, and they're not gonna keep going with me in the boat. Okay. Sorry. 
interrupting your boat trip. Oops. Hey, the bug stood still so I could take its picture. I just... Oh no, it disappeared. <laughs> Oops. I grab these. Can I get out? I need to... You can stand on the lily pads if you get stuck in the water. This is what I unlocked yesterday. Um, Promi has a potion shop. That's also why I dressed up like a witch because, like, how could I not? Oh, I didn't track down more potion cards. Ochako. Okay, so he was running around. We need to find him. We get a potion card. And then... Um, and then she'll teach us to make more potions. I just started throwing random stuff in it yesterday. <laughs> and that seemed to work. Um, so I actually have quite a few potion recipes from throwing random things in it. I wonder if we could decorate this. Like, I kind of want to decorate the house, but I also feel like I should probably wait on the furniture and use it for the different quests. Um, I don't really need to be running through the swamp. We need to go over to where the volcano is. I love the little glow buddies. Zip line go over there or does this go back home? I feel like this might just go back home. Either way, let's let's ride the zip line. My little feet dangle. <laughs> I just keep seeing things down there I need to collect. Oh, we're over here now. Okay. And there is a lot of useful stuff here. I feel like I have not really explored this area. Because the mines are so big, the volcano is so big, and just everything starts looking the same to me. So I've not been paying attention to the map to be like, oh, I've seen this, I haven't seen this. I did make an additional um, stamina apple, the golden apples, so I can go a little bit further now. To do all the fishing too. Wait, why do I? Is it just like no, you can't climb up here, or there's probably going to be stairs around the corner? And it's just like, why don't you take the stairs instead of climb? Yep. <laughs> oh, but it's just a house. What about up here? Oh, there we go. What's up here? Oh, the bridge. Um, oh right, Peckle is one that I think once we gift him today, I don't remember what he likes, but that should unlock another one of the quests for us. So where is he? Because he's probably the closest. Oh, Pom Pom Burns the closest. Um, let's... Yeah, let's fast travel to Peckle because I'm gonna get very lost on the way. Which one? I think he's Gemstone Town. What does. Oops. <laughs> um, why do I always have only one stars for him? I have no idea what he likes. That would be better. The chicken! Hang on. <laughs> the rockadoodlers, there's always like one or two here, and if they if you lose them, I don't find them again. Alright, so we have a new quest from Peckle. 4306. I need to I need a new sheet of paper is what I need. It's so much easier for the timestamps if I have some idea of when the quests are. Alright. 
Let's talk to Peckle, get our new quest. Oh hey, I was looking around town and I think this old place might be a dance hall. Dance hall. And since you know how much I love dancing... I was thinking we could try to get it back in full swing. Come on, let's go check it out. Alright. Bring back the swing, one of the crystal quests. I think we may have found at least some of those crystals in one of the previous live streams. Okay, so unfortunately it doesn't seem like it has any power. Tried flipping the switches and poking around, but nothing happened. Any ideas? Looks like it needs some power crystals, because what doesn't? Cheese and crackers! How are we gonna find those? Chaco Cat's been helping me, and I have a device, and I may have some of these in my pocket already. Sounds like you know what you're doing, so I'll leave it to you. And I think I did find them before. <laughs> so we just get to talk to him. Welcome in, Cineclouds. Um, alright, so I guess we'll just talk to him. And Chaco Cat shows up. You're back. <laughs> I didn't really leave. Chaco Cat stopped by after I told him about those crystal thingies. Yep, I came right over when Peckle said you were on the hunt for more power crystals. Let's get this place powered up. Um, can I just click it? This is like so fast. <laughs> oh my. I don't hear any music. Oh, there we go. Check it out. This must be another one of Top Hat's memories. And Top Hat is back. Hello again. There you are, Top Hat. It's good to see you again. It's good to be back. My emotional processors could not handle being abandoned again. Goodness, in that flashback, it looked like you two were at the soda tower. Is it exploding? I think so. I remember my partner and I wanted a place... wanted a place on the island that felt like a proper wilderness vacation. So we built Gemstone Town, which became a wild hit among guests. Out here, the tumble bugs can tumble freely. And guests can take on the challenge of rock climbing. But my partner always wanted to go bigger and make things more extreme. One time this resulted in an overfilled soda tower with some explosive results. The soda explosion made me more nervous than him and presented some large challenges. I would rather not talk about it. Well, I guess the good news is that Gemstone Mountain and the dance hall are back up and running. Yes, indeed, that's worthy of at least a little celebration. Exactly what I was thinking. Let's boogie down to some business. Can I ask you for another favor? I think a grand opening is in order. Could you help me invite people to a party here at the dance hall while I get things set up? I give them these. And everybody's invited. So we have dance hall invitations. How could I turn down such a fascinating invitation? Hang out with friends in the dance hall. That would be lovely. My sensors indicate that there are still more power crystals located near Mount Hothead. Oh, so that's the only one I have left. I received purple power crystal. Purple power crystal crafting plants. Decorative purple power crystal crafting plans. Why does it feel like a tongue twister to say that? Hand out invitations for the grand of Well, do I do it this way, or...? Okay, yeah, not you. So I guess I don't need to invite everybody who's here, because they're already here. But I think I need to go see everyone else and give them invites to the dance hall. 
Pom Pom Perun is over here somewhere. Come on. I still haven't found what I'm supposed to do with those shinies that I keep collecting. There we go. I like that you can glide right to the doorway from there. Um. Wait, how do I... Oh, you know what? I guess it's... It would be gifting them? Yeah, it's gifting. I feel silly. I feel like I want the quest to all be I hit the button by accident, but... Um... Like, I want the quest button to always be the same button. And switching it to gifting is strange to me. Wait, didn't I already give him one? Why is this still here? it's still here okay I feel like they shouldn't maintain that in your inventory as a giftable thing once you've actually gifted them I'm gonna give him his regular gift since we're here anyway oh rustic standing lamp okay ice cream Ice cream feels like a safe gift because it's one tag that matches one heart. Wait, the other one gave me more things though. I know he likes those, but he definitely likes this. Okay. Let's maybe fast travel to... She's up there, so maybe we do that. But which one is it? This one. And I do need to get those fire blooms up here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, I missed it. Um, so we need to give her one of the invites. And then... Oh! So the volcanic guitar seems to be her, like, perfect item. Tropical side table for getting her to level 5. What else do I have? Why don't I have anything that's, like, level 2 for her? Because she's going to be the next one. Like, we need her to level 7, so I don't know if I should just give her, you know, like, random stuff. Or if I should try and see if I can give her something better. Did we invite her already? Thank you. Thank you for telling me. Um, we do have the little daily quest for her to get the fire blooms. Let's try the mini game that's up here. Well, I guess we can come back and try the mini game that's up here. Let's. I'll finish one quest at a time. <laughs> um. See. Nobody there. I guess a lot of folks are down here at the resort. Um, who's further away? I think I want to go under. Where's underwater? Here we go. I'm a mermaid. Um. I get distracted in this game so easily just swimming around underwater and picking stuff up. So give him his invite. And then since I'm here, I'm gonna give him, I guess, random other gifts. I did find... I found like one fish. <laughs> but like only one fish that was two hearts for him. Okay. 
Alright, and one more. I don't know, this is on top so it makes me think he's gonna like it better, but I have no idea. Friendship up, and we're now good friends. I don't know what that means, but okay. And then, I think, is everybody else... What is this? Get up. Trash. Everything underwater is either a shell or trash. At least that's what it seems like. So we need to head back to the main part of the island, I think. And then we should be able to find everybody else. I don't know if I can climb up whatever this is, but I guess so. Stick. Ooh, rubber. Most of the stuff seems like it spawns in the same place. So if I could just remember where I picked things up before, there's like very often like that same material in the same place. Not always, but pretty close. Like I got two pineapples in that location yesterday. Okay, invite. got her. We've got Hello Kitty in her shop. Cafe. Oops. <laughs> She's gonna bring a cake. Not a bad idea. And I'm taking his picture instead of handing him stuff. Is he not allowed to come? This dude is dancing all the time. Why can't we invite him? I feel kind of bad. I thought everybody was invited. Why not? Like, if we're all dancing at the dance hall... He doesn't need to be in his shop. Was he there and I missed it? I don't think he was, right? I, I can't invite him either? I mean, I'm just giving him his regular gifts since he ran away from me last time. But like, what, why not? <laughs> feel kind of bad that they're left out. No, I don't. I want to do this. Except I don't have anything cool for you. I do have like a million of these snails, so that feels fine. Level 7? Fish Whisperer. Companion ability upgrade. We're already at 2 out of 4 for that one. Have another snail, I guess. Oh, and then it just says talk to Peckle at night to start the party. So, like, but I didn't invite everybody, I only invited some people. Maybe they're gonna show up anyway. They, they each bring a friend. Maybe we got everybody. Oh, wait, I need to find you. Come back here, you have my recipe! <laughs> um. Who wants to be Komomi's next customer? We got a potion recipe card. So we're waiting for it to be nighttime so that I can go back and talk to Peckle. So in the meantime, we're doing the potion quest. Me. I see a stick. Mm. 
I do really like that even though the quests are kind of locked, you know, like the Peckle one, we couldn't start until today when I hit level 5 friendship. But I, all the things for it were things that I could already collect without having the quest unlocked. That's why it went so quickly. So like that keeps the game playable. Because it's not like I have to wait until the quest unlocks to go get all this stuff for it. I mean sometimes, but not always. So we'll give Kuromi the recipe card. And it looks like it is a speedy walking potion. So I need to do some potioning. <laughs> speedy walking potion is these glowy things and a cube of tofu. gifted her anything today I think. I feel like I only have pumpkins but they give you so few pumpkins each day. Oh I needed to brew two of them. <laughs> All right we'll do nope not that this one. Um, yes. With how few pumpkins there are, like, I want to give her jack-o'-lanterns, but I only get enough pumpkins to make, like, one jack-o'-lantern each day. Okay, and now we have to give Pachaco one of those. Let's give her a pumpkin since we're here. It's so little. The game has made me really like spiders, because the spiders in this game are all really cute. And they have silly names, which I appreciate. Am I going a different way? Why am I seeing more things I can do? Yeah, since we use those little glowy things in potions now, I have to make sure I'm picking up like all of them each day. So that if it comes a time when I'm like, I need a potion, I can just make it. Alright. <laughs> Go back down. Oh, I see a mushroom I should have picked up. That's another thing I should have picked up. I need to get water. Taco Cat's not- Ooh, I missed that pineapple each of the times we've come through this path. So we need to find Pachaco and give him the speedy walking potion. Rosie! Look what you can do! Hen, isn't it exciting? Also, thank you very much. It's... It's so new, it is, like, startling. <laughs> but thank you. That is, uh... 
You're our third, uh, no, you're our second super chat, like, ever. Where's the little puppy? <laughs> Honestly, I was waiting for, like, stream elements to kick you out for it. Second is the best, yeah. <laughs> Where is the thing? Where's that speedy walking puppy? I can see you on the map. He's going so fast. Maybe I should be using the speedy walking potion too. Track him down. Wait, wait, wait. Where is he? Oh, he's standing still. <laughs> he's just gone back to his normal place. <laughs> so I'm yeah I still haven't figured out why stream elements seems to time out the use of YouTube emotes and I want to figure it out because if I do make custom emotes now that we're able to do that I can't have stream elements like banning everybody or timing everybody out when they use the custom emotes so I don't know I don't know how to fix that part. I haven't come across anybody else finding the same thing happening. I'm supposed to use a walking potion myself. All right, we're gonna be speedy walking. Um, is it, no, no. Oh, thank you, Brooke. I forgot to do any shout outs. Is there, you haven't seen that happen anywhere else? I do have like, so because I was getting a lot of not safe for work bots, um, there are certain emotes that I do have in stream elements, like, you know, if somebody's using a certain number of these particular emotes, you know, delete the message kind of a thing. And so I wonder if there's, you know how in a word, there's word similarity? Like, I wonder, does it do that with emotes? Like, that doesn't, I didn't know it could. All right, we're going to be speedy walking. I don't know where we're going to have to speedy walk to. Am I going faster? I don't feel like I'm going any faster. Now I want to test all the potions. <laughs> no, like, let's do a lap without it and then do it a lap again. decided to go straight on through. Okay. Has to go tell her about the potion. Tell her about the potion and probably just give her some more pumpkins. I feel like I'm getting a little bit better at navigating the swamp. But only a little. I really like the pumpkin house. Or the potion shop, whatever it is. Oh, I just talked to her, right? Well, we're on track to get all these potion cards eventually. Why don't you come back tomorrow and we'll continue to locate the other missing cards. Alright, let me give her some more pumpkins, I guess. It really should be jack-o'-lanterns. I just don't have enough pumpkins to do it. level 9 spooky bookcase. I feel like I'm really expanding my furniture collection. Okay. Um, is it night yet? It is not night yet, so we still can't talk to Peckle to continue with that quest. Maybe? I really like the balloons. I wonder, um... Do we have enough time to go do the little magma thing? I don't have a good sense of time in this game. Like how long it takes before it's nighttime. Also, if anybody's just coming in, I am also a mermaid. <laughs> That's the thing that I did between our last two streams. Wait, I need to actually climb to get up there. This was maybe not my best route. Let's fast travel and go try out that this isn't a map. 
Let's try the Magma Blossom game. Um, because I haven't done that yet. And we need to collect two for our daily quest. And I haven't seen any because I can't remember where they're from. Wait, she's still here. Where was it? Ah, got it this time. I missed him last time we were up here. We don't need to climb everything. I mean, I guess I'm going up here. I'm not going up here. I can't go up here. I mean, I can go up here. I just can't go up here that way. See? Just like Zelda, you know? You're like, wow, I play Tears of the Kingdom, except it's really expensive, and I don't like fighting monsters, and I like cute things, and it might be hard. Just play this game, you know? And climb, have your stamina wheel run out quickly. But you get to glide with balloons instead, and the puzzles are easier, and you don't have to fight anything. <gasps> Is this... We found another picture we have to take. That is not how we do that, though. Some of the moblins are cute. I feel like I haven't seen very many moblins. I do kind of like the monsters, and I feel bad for killing them in uh, Tears of the Kingdom. So I'm like, they're just, they're sitting here having a campfire, you know, they're doing a cookout, and then we come in and blow them all up. Why? Do we have to do that? Did I not select it? There we go. Now I have my camera out. Uh, let's do something cute. There we go. Feel bad for the ones with the mom and babies? That's just wrong. <laughs> do you mean like the... I feel like the big ones have like a captain or something as their name. Um, what do you want to do? This is where that one was. If if that helps, if you're looking for those guys and getting stuck. I think this may also be the game I was looking for. I'm gonna switch back to my bug net. So if I see a bug, I'm just not fast enough. Alright, I know nothing about this game other than it cost me a game ticket. So we're gonna try it. Alright, we have three minutes. Find as many magma blooms as you can. Alright. I don't know how this works. I don't know how this works. Hey! Um... How do you... Okay. <laughs> I was like, how do you do stairs? I'm like, ascend! Ascend! I keep doing that. Like... Um, do you think we want to go up, or do we want to go across? Oh, come on! <laughs> it was right there! How could I possibly do anything else? Oh, maybe I can go higher first? I can go higher first. Hey, but I haven't, like... Excuse me? I don't know... What... Game? You need to get better at the, uh... Maybe we'll go to the left this time, but also... Like, why does it do things like that? I feel like the resets could be a little bit better. Well, there's one. It's too, it's too far away, though. I thought, to be honest, I thought there'd be more reachable magma blooms sooner. Um. We got one. I just, uh, you know, feel like there could be more, more quickly. <laughs> okay, here's another one. Now I feel like I'm playing the lava levels in Mario. Oh no, there's geysers, like, like the bad kinds, not like these guys that are helping me go up. All right, but like, there's nothing over there for me. Oh, okay, I need to go. Kinda high, but not like that high. No. How do I get on that one? Do you think I need to approach from the other side? Because if I go too high, like there's this thing here. Go, 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 go. All right, I don't think I can get there from here. Oh, 
Here's one. What are you doing? Okay, just because I'm close to a wall doesn't mean you need to reset my position. Okay. Can I, can I go any higher? No. Do I go back down? Yes. Don't tell me my timer's running out. I'm only just finding the little flower guys now. You all want that one. I'm in the lava. <laughs> I like the Apple game better. Like, this one was a lot of work for not as much payout as I was hoping for. Yeah, he only gave me five obsidian shards. The other one gave me a whole hat and additional presents and a whole lot more apples. Oh no. Is this the exit? How do I leave? You're finally back on the Disney grind? <gasps> Fuck. Um, you've almost got all the biomes? Nice. I debated about which game to stream today, because I need to do my dream snaps submission. Hey, there's a flower. Look, this is how easy I want it to be. Like, I need it to be more easter eggy, where you're just like, I can see the next one, like I pick something up, I walk like one step, I can see and get to the next one. So did that take care of- we had a quest for that. Did that clear it? Where were those? Those were down in the daily ones, so I think the daily ones are done now. Is it night? It's almost night, maybe. Like, I was reading this as being noon with the sun with the little arrow in the middle. But I... It might be not be bad. I don't know where I'm going. I was just like, I can hop over here. Let's keep hopping. I like the way my little duck hops. I also like the way my little duck can somehow walk up the side of the mountain. I spoke too soon. Like, I think we're gonna be able to go open the dance hall soon. Come on! Hop, 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 hop. Oh, there's a ledge. Let's go to the ledge. <laughs> I don't know if this is the place that I, I have been up to before or if this is the place where I was continuously finding the edge of the map. Yeah, I think I found the edge or an edge that it doesn't want me to go down. Not sure though. Let's drop into the water and find out. Whee! Oh, I'm fine. The way my little legs like wiggle. Oh, I can't swim any more that direction. I see. Okay, thank you. Clearly, I've been here before. Oh, now I'm just getting sand dollars. Comic. I've unlocked this one, right? I must have. Um. Out of the water. What should we do while we wait for an echo? Ooh, 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 ooh. Cute thing. And another magma bloom. I should touch. I should check the friends app and see who I've not gifted all the gifts to. Like, what is up with this broken surfboard? Are they saying this used to all be water? Maybe? I don't know what I need these for either. I'm just like... Pick all this stuff up because you don't know.
I feel like for a while, I, the almonds, I was always finding them in pairs, but today that doesn't seem to be the case. Like there's just one when I'm finding them. I'm wondering what these are going to be. Like the empty billboards that are everywhere. What are we going to be doing with those? Fishy! I wonder how much more we need to do before we'll be able to catch the, like, all the critters that are underwater? Also, we're gonna be opening the dance hall, and it seems like a lot of these major quests kind of like... Do you think I can dive off of here? I feel like I can. It's so cute. You should play, Rosie. It's, uh, you know, it's Apple Arcade. What? There's a chest? There's still so many things. A white dye pouch. I'm playing on my Mac laptop and it works so well. It has full controller support. You can also play on iPad and uh, iPhone, but I haven't tried that yet. It's supposed to be able to, I think, like... I should be able to pick up my iPad and just keep playing on this save without a problem, but I haven't tried that yet. Where am I? This is weird. I wouldn't have expected that to be so deep. And this is right where I was, right? Yeah. What's up here? Uh, this is not a helpful camera. Ooh, come on. And this thing. Don't like these trees. Well, <laughs> I think they just remind me of like wasp nests, and then I'm like, oh no. All right, um, you have to be close to nighttime. I guess let's check the map. Working while you do a million little braids on your kids. Oh my gosh. I hope your fingers do well. Um, I wonder if we can continue going in this direction or not. Let's see. What was This is not what I was going to do. I was going to check the app. So I wanted to see for friends. So we still can give Choco Cat. We can still gift Peckle? Really? Oh, nice guys. Everybody else is done. Let's see what it is that she likes. Ooh, we get a new avatar palette when we unlock that. And then we, but we need to get to level seven before we can get to the next main story quest. Some music, metal, and fire. Um, gears, books, and chocolate, something like that. I don't know that I have anything that's kind of the intersection of those. I wish that the crafting recipes, when you open them up, would kind of tell you, you know, what they are. Oh wait, where is... I wanted to make stuff at the pizza oven because I haven't done that yet. And maybe that'll give us some options for gifting. So I think it's back really close to this spot. I just, it's so refreshing to play a game where everything is just so smooth for the most part. Like, it just works. No. <laughs> where is the piece oven? It's nearby, right? I think it's nearby. Did I go to the wrong place? I was pretty sure it was very, very close to, to this. I don't know what you are, but I want to try to catch you. <laughs> Tiger Snoot. The names of all the creator, creator, critters are so good. It pays to go around to the weird, hard to reach places. 
there tend to be resources. There we are. I haven't made a pizza yet. Uh oh. Oh, okay. I was like, I can't make anything. Can. Um. Let's try this because we still have pachacos that we can give gifts to, and he tends to like tofu. Tofu pizza, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Um, what else should we put on it? Almond pizza? That seems weird. Strawberry pizza? Oh, pumpkin pizza? I don't think she's gonna like it, but I wanna try. Veggie pizza? Okay. I feel like that's not gonna maintain the fall or Halloween tags that I really need it to. What else? Pineapple pizza? I mean, that's a real thing, right? Pineapple pizza. Um, ap apples? We have a lot of apples. We have a lot of bananas. I feel like you could make a dessert pizza. Notice that I have no cheese or tomatoes. It's literally dessert pizza. Alright, how about sugar kelp? Is that just gonna be another dessert pizza though? Yeah. What about like maybe the fruit make like fruit pizza? I don't know. did. It made fruit pizza. Okay. I like when the, the cooking things are intuitive, but what about if I put the fire on it? Do you think it's just gonna make like a default pizza pizza? It's gonna be like a hot and spicy pizza? Spicy pizza. Okay. about the weird milk stuff or the spin app, whatever that is. Let's find out. Cheese pizza because it's a milk? Alfredo pizza? How fancy. Bananas? I imagine they're gonna make a fruit one. Let's see what this weird ingredient makes. And then it looks dark so we need to get to the dance hall. A veggie pizza, but look, it's like purple. <laughs> Alright. I do need this. Um. Where's the dance hall? You know what? I think we should probably fast travel. I had to catch it. It was right there. Alright. Fast traveling back to the dance hall, which is what? Gem... I saw it. Gemstone Town. Where is it? This... this way? Alright, going into the dance hall for Peckle's quest. Can I also dance? Hot diggity dog, this is awesome. Thanks so much for helping me out, I couldn't have done it without you. Bring back the swing. Purple power quest <laughs> purple power crystal quest. Complete. If you go near them, they'll face you. Where is he going? Like this is his thing. And he's just like, oh, he wants to dance in the back on his own. Can I zoom out? I can zoom out. I wish you could hide the camera stuff so that you could get, like, better shots. I think I have a dancing emote. Um, there we go. I'm dancing too. We're all dancing in my melody. And Karomi are totally judging my dancing. <laughs> I have not figured out where the photos go when I save them. I haven't been able to find them yet. 
I think those two are my favorite, and, um, like, she heard me. Can we go up here with the band? Oh, look at that. Are those... What are those in the... Oh, this is getting a little close to me and it's creeping me out. What are those guys? Are they peanuts with feet? I want to stand on top of the drum set, but it's like an invisible wall. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the french fry is kind of cool. Oh. French fry is very, um, mobile. Those lights are in my way. Well, no. We can do better than that. What? Where's my emote? That might be the best that I get. I don't know. Oh, I can stand on this. Can I go up to the rafters? Because it felt like maybe I could. Can I climb the wall? No. And everybody's here, even if I didn't invite them. Look, there's pictures of the band over here on the wall. I do still, I can gift him additional things. Oh, everybody's here. This makes gifting super easy because we know where they all are. I've made anything though. Yeah. I haven't like made anything good. Ooh. That went up a lot, even though it was only one heart. So I feel like the colors do mean something. I mean, I feel like the iron should be more, but I don't know. Okay, I feel like that one didn't go over as well because she only gave me one dough. She had been giving me like at least four generically. Red Panda Avatar Palette. See, now I could actually go back and be that cat with the other colors. The problem is now I'm attached to my little duck. So like I love the idea of expanding avatar things, but I just want those, I want those at the beginning, you know? So when they finally do add bunnies and stuff, it'll be like, oh. So they did say they're hoping to add additional species. Wait, who else did we not gift that I need to give gifts to? Is it Choco Cat? I feel like it might have been. There's so few options. Let's go get more chocolate coins, maybe. What do we get at level 7? Story quest! We unlocked a new story quest with him. Reboot the robots. I mean, I feel like that's what we did because this is a robot band, but... I guess let's find out what that is. Oh. Maybe it's because he's in here, and until we walk out of here, that won't start. Let's check my phone. So those I still need to do things for. Yeah, this I need to be able to level up friendship with her to level 7 and then be able to do the last part of that. Oh. Wait for morning. Figure out how to power up the Doki Doki Yummy Chums band. Is that is that a different band than this band? Okay, so there are little time things. When it says morning, though, it does mean in-game morning. Um, let me check other quests then, because... 
does say that I have a red dot on one of them. Heavy metal hoedown. Oh. Reach level 10 with Peckle and complete the quest Fire Up the Volcano. I don't think I even have the quest Fire Up the Volcano. I'm guessing that would be something I get after this one, which are really close to. Um, what are you? That's not what I wanted to do. I haven't actually looked at these. So yeah, those are all dependent on that one. Level 8. I feel like the one waiting for morning is definitely the next one we're gonna do. Oh, level seven with him. I feel like that's so within reach. Hey, I'm still missing a piece of lost luggage. I don't know where Kuropi's luggage is. And the nature preserve, I have to wait until I get a pickaxe or something. So in the morning, we'll be able to do that. We should harvest more chocolate coins if they respawn. Um, let's see. And if they do respawn, yeah, they are by the pirate ship. Yes. So this is the only source of chocolate that I know of. Are the chocolate coins by the pirate ship? And I didn't think about this as being like a daily harvest until I realized how low I was on them. But I guess one of your dailies would be <laughs> harvesting chocolate coins from the sunken pirate ship. Which is super easy if you're a mermaid because then you can stay underwater so much longer. there were way more the first time. I also really want to be able to get like duplicates of my hats so I can give all the little guys hats. If you ever feel like you just need to chill out, I feel like go diving in this game as a mermaid. It's a little stressful when you have a very small amount of stamina, but... I've been happy with how quickly things have been progressing. And the way that the quests are unfolding, it seems like they're just, there's gonna just keep being more stuff. And if you don't play as many hours as I did in your first couple days, you're going to have way more materials, too. But you can still get this far in just, like, a couple days. I feel like there should be more of them down here. There's one like inside one of these tube things the first time I saw them. I haven't found that one yet, but I don't remember I don't remember where that was because there's so many there's just so many tube things. Should we try the button? I don't think I've done an underwater button successfully yet. You can get a speed boost as one of the friendship rewards if they're coming with you. And I wonder if it's like necessary. Oh, I missed a ring back there. I didn't see it. Hey, Kiroi, welcome in. Have you opened? The potion shop yet? I did that yesterday off stream. 
I can't believe I missed that one. You would have had this. I don't even know where that button was. Somewhere up higher? I thought there'd be more chocolate coins, to be honest. I have to be around here somewhere. Still nighttime? Alright. Maybe I got too far away from a pirate ship. No, it's here. Anything on the pirate ship itself. Have fun. Thanks for stopping in. chocolate coins? Did I get them all? I like this little octopus. Is that one in... Yes. There we go. Here's another one. The camera angles in this game are so tricky. I wonder if I've already collected all the power cells that we're going to need for the final, well, as far as we know, final one. Another strawberry crate. I should probably decorate another place and go say hi to the visitor that we have today. Another picture. we have enough to turn those in. I don't remember what I've turned in in the past, so I don't know, don't know how many more I have. Alright, maybe we will come up this way. Where am I? <laughs> oh, there was a comic on that one. Oh, I didn't take the net back out. Oh yeah, we need to say hi to him. No, that's the sign. Talk to the person. Ugh. The way that the characters can get too close together. Ugh. Oh, he's gonna give me something apple pie that we can give to Hello Kitty. That's one of her two star items. What's I gonna do? Let's check in on our visitors. On here I haven't really done much of this. I've unlocked a spooky cabin and I haven't decorated it. I kind of want to but I I don't think any of the visitors so far. Oh, so we can't have these guys yet? Whoops. Alright, so must have every piece of fur furniture furniture? Is that... I don't... I don't know what that icon is. I don't know what all the pieces of that kind of furniture there are must be in Seaside Resort to be near Hello Kitty, I must have two bread items, and five pieces of Hello Kitty furniture. I wonder if I have any of that. Can I put like, like would that be like I can put a pie out or something and that would count? I don't know if I have enough Hello Kitty furniture. What if I were to re- can you remodel? Like can I go to the house that I made for Daniel? and just like put additional Hello Kitty furniture in there and that would count? Or does that, can you not do that? I imagine you can't do that while he's here, but I'm gonna see what happens if I try to go in his house while I'm here. Yeah. 
Can I really redecorate? <gasps> I can... I can put down more things, even though he's here. So do you think that this cabin could be used for either one of them? I mean, I kind of hope so. It's the only one I have decorated so far. I think everything I had in here was already Hello Kitty themed. And then she needed bread items. I'm sure they're called something cuter in the game, but this is my bread category. I mean, how many did we need? How would I even put this here? I've only got like info and a moat. Yeah, none of my buttons work. No, now I can just emote about apples. I'm thinking about apples. Wait, what is that? Pick an item. Oh! That is how you do it. Okay, so to put things on tables, walk up to the table, click the button for the hand icon, and then you can put things. And I, I feel like I should have been able to put more than one item here. Let's see what happens if I try to do that. Oh, it just switches it. We don't want that. Do items have to go on tables? What was her order? I have no idea if this is going to work or not. Five pieces of Hello Kitty furniture, two bread items. But I feel like I put two things. Didn't I? I put two things. <laughs> Are you only able to put down the tiny things? Like, if you have tables? Because that's what it's seeming like. This is going to be just like early Animal Crossing where everybody needs tables. Okay, did that do it? Yes. Okay, so even though the things like the apples fall under that menu, they don't have the tag the way that the baked goods do. So it's Seaside Resort. It has two baked goods and five Hello Kitty furniture. And I did all that redecorating while Dear Daniel was here. So yeah, I didn't make a second cabin. I just kept decorating his. Oh, it's morning, it's morning. Who do we need to go see in the morning? Is it Choco Cat? Let's go, let's go, let's go. I wonder if the robots broke or something after I left and that's what this is gonna be? That bug just disappeared, huh? Oh, he's not here. I wonder where he is. Romy is on the beach. That's unusual. Oh, he's still up there. Alright. I'll just fast travel up there, I think. Nope. <laughs> Alright, he should be on the map somewhere. Is he still at the dance hall? There we go. in a bit of a quandary. I'm here for you. Indeed, another set of eyes would be most appreciated. Because it's easier to just show you right over here in the dance hall. Reboot the robots. Peckle is just going to be here dancing every day, all day. All right. Quite perplexing. I'm sure you're familiar with the Doki Doki Yummy Chums band. 
Observe what happens when I activate them. See, the robot band plays for a moment before cycling down into sleep mode. Well, they did just play all night. Maybe they need a nap. A power surge has erased their programming. Oh, he's so sad he's crying. The Doki Doki Yummy Chums need a total reboot. Well, first we need to locate the master control room. I haven't done that. Second and perhaps most challenging, we need to locate five special discs. They're called floppy discs and they'll reset the band's programming. Oh, I have found like one of those. <laughs> it's how early computers stored information. There's five floppy disks needed to reboot the band. Floppy disks are missing from the technical manuals. And scattered all around Gemstone Town. I think I haven't done a great job of exploring Gemstone Town. Floppy disks may be out in the open, possibly sitting on boxes or near the cave entrances. You might have to ask a friend if they have seen them. Chances are they won't even know what they're used for. While you engage in your search, I'm going to read through these 24 technical manuals in order to locate the master control room. Somewhat of a subpar speed reader. Is this a time lock? Okay. <laughs> I'll endeavor to do my best. Best of luck locating the floppy disk. Alright, I'm gonna check my inventory and see. Okay, I thought I had one. I have three of them already, so there's two more we need to find. Um, and he did say that we can ask the villagers for help. So I wonder if Peck will know since he's like basically from here. I think I saw something on top of a box by one of the visitor cabins. Okay. Chicken! Rock a doodler. Alright. Checking around the visitor cabin. Oh, hey, what's that? That is a comic. I don't remember where the visitor cabins are, and I'm not sure that they're actually marked on the map. Let's see if we can find these floppy disks. Um, I think they're all that yellow color. Here's one visitor cabin. I don't see it here. Like, I remember the shape, but I'm not sure if I have that particular bug yet. Oh, there's tracks. Okay, there was a comic in there that I couldn't even see. Oh, another crate. There are the mines. I don't know if there's going to be some in the mines. Those would be much harder. Don't think from what he said. It sounded like the entrances to temples was one of them. And on top of crates. And now I have two of these. So if I do still need to donate it, I could still give one away if I needed to. Another picture. Oh, my camera. And that one is here, if that's at all helpful when you're looking for them. Switch back to the net. Anything. Do you think this is real back here, or is this the end of the map? Eee. That is... that is the edge. <laughs> For now. Alright, 
right, where are the visitor cabins here? I wonder where this goes. I don't want to use up my sparks in case I need something. I guess I could give it one. Yeah, sure. Let's see where it goes. See it? Keep your eyes out for a floppy disk down there. I see a green bug. Can you jump off? Oh, there's a chest. No, go back. Let me jump off. What is that down there? Have I been here before? I probably have been here before, but we're on a quest, so I'm going to go back so we're in the right biome. I wanted to let you jump off. Like, why not? Jump, 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 jump. Oh well. Do it the old fashioned way with balloons. Alright, somewhere over here? <laughs> I didn't see the floppy disk, but I did see things that I didn't have yet, and I want them. I guess this way? I, I can't tell where the zipline went. No, it's not down here. That's not what I want. Go back up. You make me reset so frequently. Go back up. Yeah, but where was it then? Please tell me we could climb. No! <laughs> Whoops. I didn't re let it refill all the way. Hey, here it is. shiny chest crafting plans. I haven't made any of the chests yet. I don't know what they're for. And you little bug. Oh, you escaped me. That was the little bug that we saw from the zipline. Here's the zipline shadow. Oh, look, gemstone mountain. Oasis. I don't think that this bug has very good camouflage for where it's hanging out. Like, I would have expected it in one of the greener biomes, maybe. Seems like it's just drawing attention to itself. Okay, where are the visitor cabins? Oh, what are you? Can I go in here? No, not yet. I feel like I'm gonna wish I remembered where that is at some point. Can I go down here? Nope. Wee! <laughs> um, alright. Some water over here. So we're back in this area. It's another shiny. So I haven't been to that yet. I guess the visitor houses might be more likely to be on like one of the paths. Wait, but it says we're in the oasis. I need to check. It doesn't say. So are they in the oasis or are they on... Like the gemstone mountain or whatever it's called. Because they're coming up as two separate areas and I am not sure which one is supposed to have the things on it. But if I'm going to the wrong one... And there's snow. And now there's snow. There's snow. What? Okay, I'm gonna guess not in the snow, so we'll just, just glide on back down here. I feel like we're gonna be able to go in there whenever we get, like, the pickaxe, I guess, or a giant hammer or something. 
Oh, hey, I guess we're going over the waterfall. <laughs> um, this is the place where I tend to catch that one little tum- that, that bug. I feel like this is the one place where the tumble bug lives. Okay. Been here because there's a temple. Is it on top? Is there anything on top of this one? So this says we're on Gemstone Mountain again. Is across the river also Gemstone Mountain? Is across the river real? Um. Yeah, this is the only house I keep finding. <laughs> Like, I know that there's more of them, and I've found them before, probably. Sir? Something strange near the cave. Okay. So we have near the cave and near one of the visitor houses, and... I don't know where either of those are. What is this? Okay, there's another mini game that I haven't done yet. I should probably do that at some point. Okay, I haven't been to this area because there's still like this here and I don't really recognize it. Visitor houses, there we go. <gasps> Chicken, I'm back here. Do you think we can catch it? I don't know that there's any point to catching them. I just think it's funny that I can. There's a shiny thing here. Okay, and then we need to find a cave entrance, I guess. <laughs> You're out here too. Are you gonna tell me the same thing? On the docks by his boat? Are they all just telling me, like, I was hoping that they would tell me the locations I actually had left. Okay, the dock by his boat. Now I'm finding the visitor houses. Apple slice chest has been here the whole time. I might have enough to make another stamina thing. I see a bug over there that I want. Ah, there's a chest. Have I just... I don't think I've been to this area. There is part of me that feels like the map just keeps changing. <laughs> I wonder if just some new chests spawn each day. Like, not many. No! Okay, he's sat by the dock by his boat. I do jump off of kind of a dock to get there. So here? I mean, I don't see anything. Oh, is this a dock? I feel like this is more like a bridge that I don't recognize. Yeah, they don't want you to know your way around. There is, like, I'd like a little bit more to the map in this game. Okay. Because I also, like, can't look around. So that complicates it, too. Crates. 
search for in the air. Because <laughs> I don't... So we've been told next to a visitor house, we got that one, and then we were told the dock by his boat. But I didn't see anything there, and then we were told cave entrance. And I guess I haven't really looked by the cave entrances. But like, are there any other folks? I guess it could be under? That dock is here. Oh, there is no under, so maybe not. I feel like I really snuck up on that guy. Um, Cause we just have one more, right? Okay, is this the cave entrance? No. Where is the cave entrance? Oh, there's a temple thingy. Cause they did also tell us like near temple things, temple things, probably near temple entrances. I don't, I don't remember where that, I mean, here's a cave entrance, but I don't, caves are complicated. I'm guessing it would be outside, right? Not inside. But there's more than one way to get in and out of these, right? So... Here's a different cave entrance. Oh, and is this a dock? Is this like both things at the same time? Or is that just a bridge? I guess it won't let me climb on top of that, so I hope it's not there. Can I climb up the wooden part? Oh, that's unexpected. I always forget that your stamina keeps getting used up if you're just standing there. Oh, if you look at the minimap it shows you? Oh, I guess it might, but it's not easy to see it. Welcome in, Piola. Um. Oh, I see what you're talking about. Thank you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> not talking about the cave entrance. You're talking about the floppy disk is literally on the mini map, and I didn't even see it. It does that with the other quests, so I don't know why I didn't even think. <laughs> oh, one of my favorite spiders. And a cacnid. And a picture. Thank you, Paola. <laughs> yeah, the quests are so much easier if you would just listen to the information that the game gives you. Oh my gosh. Okay. Taking another picture. You're struggling too, and then you found it. Because I remember for the soda one, there was like the picture of the soda, and that's how I was finding it. Give Chaco Cat the floppy disk. All right. Now we can go turn those in. Somewhere in this direction. This is a lot of map to learn, too. Alright, I have the floppy disk. Um. <laughs> okay, fine, you can stand on that side. Alright, most excellent. And I've ascertained the general location of the hidden master control room located on the outskirts of Gemstone Town. Okay. Following Chaco Cat on the mini-map since it's finally decided to run quickly. 
there was the potion quest you have to follow someone for it and i was doing that yesterday and they were so slow <laughs> it was just like you'd like walk two steps and then stop and wait for them so this is a much nicer pace all right where are we going do you think it's going to be somewhere that I've seen before? <laughs> when I was hanging out with Choco Cat, anytime you go over a bridge in the water, he like would fall through the bridge. And then he'd take out his balloons to try to get out. Oh. Ah. Come back. Um, do you see something I don't see? The technical manuals indicated the general area, but we're gonna have to search for the secret entrance. Secret entrance. Someone went to a lot of trouble to hide it. A hidden door or a blocked entrance. Okay, I need to drink some water and then we'll find this hidden door. All right, hidden door. Um. Is it, is it this Choco Cat? I found this. <laughs> uh, I mean, I've found so many. Oh, it's this? Well, I don't have a thing for that. Do you have any bomb flowers? Maybe a giant hammer? Nothing like the thrill of discovery. Let's go. Oh, what? It just... I didn't have to do anything, I just had to be on the quest and the boulder magicked away. There's a button. I should probably talk to him, but I really want to push the button. I guess I'll talk to him. This computer must be where the reboot for Doki Doki Yummy Chums Band is. <laughs> Alright. Um... Indeed. I'll insert the floppy disks you recovered, and you can reset the robots by pushing the red button over there. I still get to push the button. On my mark. Three, two, one. Activate. Push the button. Congrats on a job well done. I'll explore this master control room more another time. This discovery has given me more questions than answers. I digress. Ready to return to town? Ah. But... But I want to explore the cave! Don't magic me away. Oh good. He just magicked away. And there is... Not much here. Except for... Someone I can give a hat to. There has to be something else in here, right? They're not gonna just give me a secret cave with only a button in it. It's gotta be like a fancy hat or something. Yeah. Oh no. People collect buttons, that's true. Oh, hey. I'm on the computer. Oh hang on. Maybe we can do this. Turn? Turn no, you turn too far. Can't find the orb of trust. Um, which biome is that one? Cause like, I don't remember anymore. Alright, um, 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 how do I do this? Camera. Oh no, get back in the TV. No, the computer, whatever this thing is. And then, 
I'm gonna take a picture. Oh, can I not move it to a good place? But I'm thinking if we sit down. Oh, I was hoping my face would pop through the screen. <laughs> I was doing it. Oh well. I'm still taking a picture of me standing inside the computer because I can. A blade of trust, but you think they're gaslighting you. Um, are you in the... So you're looking for the orb of trust. Did you, um... You're in the, like, magic -iness, right? Like, it's not normal. You're, like, all sparkly and everything is dark. Check, um... Check by the waterfall. Yeah, the dream state thingy. Go, go look by the waterfall. Oh no, I don't have my net out. <laughs> um, where's my net? I want to like program a button that is the like a quick button for the net. Yeah, there you go. I assume you found it then, huh? All right, what are we doing now? Um, let's check check the quest. Maybe that unlocked something else. You've been looking for 15 minutes. I'm glad you found it. It is definitely tricky. I thought they told you where it was before you went to the dream state, though. All right, Hello Kitty level 11. We're not... Seven. You didn't know you could walk on air. That's the whole thing with the dream state. That's the only way you can get the orb is in that dream state. But I feel like I was able to see it or I knew that was the location before we went into that. But I don't, I don't know why. Seven. I wonder if we have any more of the flowers. We could give her one and move up on that. Eight. Everything is... I think higher friendship than we're gonna be able to get today. Seven. Let's check this. We've gifted- oh, we have to gift him still. Okay, let's go find him, give him presents. And do I have any more of those? There are these flowers. I don't know, they're like magic friendship flowers or something. We can craft another stamina apple because I have five of those now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there is a ton to pay attention to in that game and it, it only sometimes tells you in the quest log like what it was that they told you in the dialogue. Um, I don't see any more of the flowers. Oh wait, that's not everything though. I don't know which category they'd be under. So many comic books. No, those are the other flowers. They're like pink flowers is what I'm looking for. That's all just crafting plans. There's so many crafting plans. I don't think it's a food. But like, some of the stuff is categorized in ways I wouldn't expect. Like, I don't expect the magma flowers to be edible. I should try out- let's try on our, uh, new blue brain hat. Um... All this furniture I have. I have so much of the spooky set. Should we decorate a spooky cabin? Also, I want to see- do you think we can actually put fish in the aquarium tank? Oh, and we should see <laughs> we should see what my melody has for sale in her shop i haven't actually looked Oops. this is what i got for doing the apple mini game <laughs> i have a brain hat now it actually looks like surprisingly good up close i really wasn't sure from the tiny icon What's an appropriate... Okay, I mean, that's just cute. <laughs> I 
All right. We might wear the brain hat around a little bit. Should we change the outfit overall? It's giving Mojo Jojo. It is, isn't it? What else do I have that we could wear with it? I haven't worn the Explorer outfit at all. We wore this for like two seconds and then I got the witch outfit. I have a mining jumpsuit. See, my favorite things are the hats. <laughs> I like a lot of the hats. Do I still turn into a mermaid? Can I be like a... A brain exposed mermaid? I think I only get the perks if I have the entire outfit. Like if I'm wearing the pants, do I still get a tail? Well, there's like no water here. We're in the opposite place of where I need to be to test that. Gotta come across some eventually if I just keep heading. All right. Here's some water. What do you think? Do we become a mermaid? These are just puddles. I need like proper water. I am a mermaid with a Frankenstein brain. Now I'm like, is that how I get all the cool hat and things? I have to go do all the little mini games and do them well, apparently. I didn't get anything cool from the magma one, but I didn't do very well either. Can I go underwater? You can accessorize your mermaid tail however you like. Although I don't know what sort of perks I get from it, like if I can stay under as long or not. Alright, let's fast travel back to the main area. Go back up. And we need to gift Pochaco and we need to check out my Melody shop and see if there's anything new in there. <sighs> I feel like... He, I, I don't know what he likes. I mean, I know what he likes, but he doesn't seem to really like anything that I can give him. Right. <laughs> Racing red avatar palette. Alright, so even more colors. And then we've gifted him everything we can. Maybe I should take a look at the different colors that we... Where is she? Wait, I can still do stuff even if she isn't... Even if she isn't here? But where is she? Antique standing lamp, Y side table, rustic nightstand, the aquarium tank I have one of so far, spooky lounge sofa. I want to buy everything. I'm afraid to use the rubber though because I don't have very much of it. I don't super want that item, but I don't have it. <laughs> I want to try out the aquarium. Oh, here. Sorry. I want to know where my melody went. Ugh. I haven't unlocked any more patterns, but I have unlocked a ton of different colors. I 
think this one is new? Oh, you can't see my tail. Why did my tail go away? See, I get so attached to my character in games, though, I don't want to change, like, fundamental things, like, the color and species. So then it feels like something else. But I also just really like all the different options that you get. This is so cute. See, I feel like if I had had this color palette, I probably... <laughs> I was gonna say, I probably would have went with that one. Um, wait, do I not have the same color palettes here? I thought they... So when I checked them initially, the color palettes were unlocking for everyone. Like, all of the different characters, the first few. Oh, that's cute, too. Um, oh, wait, maybe they are? They're just down here? No. Oh. Like, I definitely have more. That's cute. But I don't have... Oh, there they are. It just wouldn't scroll the first time, I guess. They're all so cute. I just, like... <laughs> like, let me just keep making these. Alright, I would not have used this one because there's too much red. What was the one that I thought was cute? I'm gonna keep my duck. I just... I just like playing with it. Alright, how do I get out of here? Oh, you can also randomize. That's kind of fun. How do I get out of here without... There's no back out button? They... So... They need to add a button on the screen that is like, step away from the mirror without changing anything. Like, that needs to be a thing. Because I want to try things out and then not have to uh, wear them. Oh, I look like a little mad scientist. What do I have to do to see my adorable tail? Okay, so I can't wear the mermaid tail and still have my tail when wearing pants. And then I have so many fun hats. Okay, what? <laughs> let's, let's be a little mad scientist for the time being. And where is my melody? You downloaded Disney Magic Kingdoms last night, too? What is that on? Because I remember seeing it, like, occasionally, but I didn't realize it had come out, and I don't know what it is. Where is she? Where is everybody? There seems to be a lack of characters on the map at the moment. Do you think they're sleeping? Do they get houses? I don't think I've seen this before. Oh, it's on iOS, but you're not sure what other platforms? And what is it? <laughs> is he not in here either? I had no idea. You can't decide if you like it, so you've started playing it then. I would like to get on that rock and make me go up on land and... Nope. It's literally just clicking on the characters to get them to do quests. You can't collect resources, can't go inside places, as far as you know. Oh. Well, what are the... But if you can't collect things and you... If you can't collect things and you can't go inside, what are the quests then?
And clearly you need to be playing this game instead. Let's go decorate the spooky cabin. I mean, I don't think it's going to do anything for us because it's not going to meet the specifications. I just kind of want to. Looks like there was something glowy over here and I wanted to look at it, but I don't see it now. Leveling up the characters by giving them tasks. Oh, and you're time locked for 13 hours. Who makes that one? Like, is that also Game Loft, or is that somebody else with a Disney license? Anybody remember where the spooky cabin is that I unlocked? And the beast. You're forgetting to pick them up because they're so tiny. Actually, let's do the apple quest. Ooh, I have an idea. Let's take a speedy potion and do the apple quest again. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good use of a speedy potion, but I, I feel like doing it anyway. Which one is it? This one? It's by Game Off, more of like a kid version of DDDV. DDV. Uh, okay. I think I will skip it then because I feel like I have enough with Disney Dreamlight Valley. I sort of, I think a lot of people expected this game to be more like pocket campy and it's, it's like a full game. Um, I have gone the wrong way. I don't know what that was, but I wish I had caught it. Oh, that apple's on a tree and it won't let me get it. Why do some of the trees have apples and some of the trees not have apples? Does it feel like I'm going any faster? I took a speed potion. Where are all the apples? I'm in the wrong part of the maze. No, okay, that's fine. You caught it. That's cute. Get the apples. Get the apples. Ooh. You got five out of 12 to level 10. Nice. Great job. Here's a prize. What are we going to get? Purple monster beanie. Okay, this is my favorite game because they give me cool hats. And some mushrooms, that's fine too. And we get apples. Alright, well, we're gonna put on our brand new hat. See what that looks like. I mean, the one we have has kind of special effects having that see-through brain and all, but like... I feel like I would wear this hat in real life. It's cute. Can I have like some some other clothes to go with it? Can I also have some perks? I don't want to always have to be a mermaid in order to like do stuff, but I'm feeling like I have to be a mermaid to do stuff. You want to check your hours in game? You feel like you're moving kind of fast? It sounds like you're moving kind of fast. I wonder if it is just like they've made it better so that you can progress progress more quickly. You always have to be. I mean, it feels like I do. Oh, here we go. So I fixed this cabin so we can decorate it. Um, how do I decorate? I don't know if I'm supposed to, but my plan is put all the spooky stuff here. The noises that it makes when you put things down. You feel like stuff is spawning in quicker than it used to? 
yeah, I, I could see them doing that. I mean, because I feel like the spawn rates when we were starting were so bad. And I would sit there and mine for hours and get like one emerald. And I was like, I want to like this game, but it's not like, I don't know. Are you spooky? Spooky standing mirror. Can you rotate things? <gasps> Can rotate things. Maybe we should put the chair with the other stuff. Are there like... I want this room to like have a fireplace or something. Um, what else do I have? I'm just gonna put all my spooky stuff in here then I'll know where it is. Spooky candelabra. I don't have any tables yet, so it just goes on the ground. I didn't think you were going to like it as much as you do. Yeah. Yeah, I felt the same with Disney Dreamlight Valley. I was like, I'm not sure I'm even going to get this. I saw somebody play it day one and I was like, all right, that looks better than I expected. And then I played it all through its brokenness and continued to play it and was surprised I liked it. I think a lot of us were... We... <laughs> <laughs> what? I I can put the why this spider? What? I can put the spider? It lags so bad sometimes. Interesting. I feel like I don't get too bad a lag playing it on the switch at least. Wait, what is? I love this frog. You're telling me I can put the frogs in here? And this guy, the bush friend, is the one that I caught in the maze. I kind of want more because it's so cute. I probably shouldn't put them in here because I don't have I don't have them in the museum yet. The ones that came from the lava area. I didn't realize you could put bugs in the house. I'm not sure that's a good thing that you can put bugs in the house. Oh, I was going to try the aquarium too. Um, lurk. <laughs> All right. Enjoy your lurk. Let's see. Can I put fish in the aquarium? All right. These are critters. They're not fish. Can I put them in the... No, it's an aquarium. They'd have to swim. I mean, the frog can swim. Oh, <gasps> You can just place them in the house. You can just place them. In the house? Are they gonna run around? Or are they gonna like sit in the corner? What? <laughs> I wonder if we're gonna get a visitor that's like, it must have bugs. <laughs> like, I wish I could put them like on the chair, like it's their house. Can I use, oh, I can use the D-pad. This is, this is tricky. Oh, did I, I might have hit B by accident because of my, yeah. I meant to put it down, but I did the thing where I hit the button that it would be if I was on the switch. Look at how their size difference. What? Is this gonna fly around? Oh, it's, it's, it's too flappy. It's too flappy. That, let's go, oh my gosh. Yeah, that needs to go away. It is way too flappy. Oh, you can take pictures in here though. So if you wanted to take a picture with a bug or critter rather, you could put them in one of the visitor houses and then you'd be able to take a picture with them. Like, yeah. I mean, I want to fill a house with all the little bugs then. Yeah, sure, we'll sit on the floor. <laughs> okay, so if it would let me take away the little camera controls on the screen. I could set up really cute pictures in here. I like this little guy. He's all like magma-like. I think I might need to put this one away 
Like, how do I, can I put fish in here? <gasps> I can put fish in here. I might need to buy more aquariums from my Melody because I can put fish in here. How many fish? Because this is small. This guy's really cute. He's got stripes. Oh, he needs a bigger tank than that. Well, that one I can't really see. Okay, so you can put one fish in the aquarium at a time, it looks like. But if you want to kind of like see them, this is a way to do that. I need to get more aquariums. Whereas the critters, you can just place in the house. Yup. Do you think there's a limit? Should we find out if there's a limit? <laughs> um, I don't think I have enough critters to, you know, completely fill the house, even if I wanted to. Oh, I love these guys. Because of their name, I think they're funny. I want to place it here. Okay, so there's a lot more decorating potential than I thought. I thought it was just, you know, fulfill the criteria and that's it. But there's so many houses. So, like, how many characters are there going to be? Because we currently have four in that app right now, but there's way more than four houses. The glow buddies, are you going to light up? Hey, I wish, I wish the flying ones were a little bit less frantic. And I wish the glowy ones would light up. Because I feel like that would... Oh, this guy's cute. Look at him. Do I have any of the tumbleweeds? I don't know that this is going to stay this way, but we are in the swamp, you know? <gasps> you could make a chicken house. Alright, when we decorate... Okay, the chicken is really fun, except I'm afraid the chicken is just going to go around eating everybody else. But when we make houses over on Gemstone Mountain, we are putting chickens in them. We're going to make a farmhouse somehow with the rustic stuff. We're going to put in a chicken, you know? The snails are... Oh, the turtle! I love the swampy snapper. I feel like... Let's save this guy for when we have, like, a reef house. Um, oh yeah, the little pumpkin spider. He's on theme. Um, who else could go in here? Oh, this guy! He's so cute. He's like a little bundle of yarn with a face. Wait, why are you... Why are you acting like you're gonna explode? Are you gonna explode? Some of these animations, though, they don't work so well. They're they're a little frantic for inside. Like the spiders look okay, you know, gently sitting back and forth. I feel like the frog looks okay, but like like the tumbly the the things from the gemstone mountain, they look like they're gonna explode. The chicken's okay. The flying things, a little too frantic. <laughs> Let's see what the snail does. Got a whole ton of these. Are you? It seems that seems reasonable. <laughs> uh, yeah. Let's. All my little friends. It's only slightly disturbing that they're all- Oh, I can't see the one in the back because it doesn't let me get, like... Oh, that's alright. He's a little... A little weird. I mean, they're all a little weird. <laughs> alright, was there anything else that I am supposed to do today? Do we have anything else open on the quest log that I can do? It looks like they're all locked. Oh, I still need to find the lost luggage. I have not come across it yet. Um, 
Visitors, so we've met her conditions. What about this one? Oh, I don't even know which furniture set is that. It's, it looks almost like fruit. Um, well, I guess we can see my furniture because I'm in here. Let's see which ones those are. I don't see anything with that tag yet. The chicken is the cutest thing ever. I just like, I see them and I feel the need to catch them, you know? Oh, let's go down to the furniture. I don't think I have a single piece of furniture that would count for that one. I have no idea. That's all right. We just we made this instead. I like it. Can I sit down? I can't even jump on these. <laughs> so no, I can't sit down. Can I turn on the light? You've been wanting all the Sanrio characters tattooed on your legs. Interesting. Is that a recent thing or are you like lifelong Sanrio is exciting? Oh, the mirrors. Even though I'm not in a shop, any of the mirrors are interactable, I guess. So I could change my look. And how you want all these little bugs. The, I, I like the little critters. I know their designs are really simple for the most part, but there's like, I like the direction that they took most of them, especially the spiders. Like the little, the guy who's got, it looks like he has a top hat, but it also looks like the little stalk at the top of a pumpkin. And their names are funny. Got one fish in all of these, and the chicken keeps everybody in line. I wish these guys weren't like, you know, little time bombs. They did. They've done a really good job with this game. I'm surprised. Um, yeah. All right. I think let's uh, get everybody into view here. <laughs> See, if it would just let me take down the HUD so that I could just have a clean shot here, like, be really nice. Um, I think I'm going to end here. Let me see. I don't... Uh, does anybody else... I haven't... I have no idea how to rate or if that has, um, like, opened as a possibility for me. Oh, let's go see Sword, if she's still on. Hang on a minute. Oh, she's just starting? Is she really just starting? Let's do that. All right. So I know there's not many of us, but if you want to keep watching uh, something, um, let's go say hi to Sword. She's playing Animal Crossing, another really cute game. Um. She's pretty chill as a streamer. Here's her link, because I don't know if I can do a live redirect or how that even works. Um, but go say go say hi to Sword. That's Katana Crossing. Um, you can put Sprouty Raid in the chat. I'll be over there in a minute or two. Not for super long. But thank you, everybody, for stopping by. We'll play more of this. There'll be videos coming out. And Wednesday, we're doing Disney Dreamlight Valley for sure. Maybe streaming tomorrow. Uh, hope to see you then.